Hey, what's up guys, it's Saints fan, and welcome back to another GTA 5 video. Today I'm going to be going through the patch list for patch 1.15. Now I went over a little bit of the new features in a video before, so if you want to go check that out, you can. I'll leave a link in the description to the patch list on Rockstar support page. It's actually not as long as some of the other ones, which I was glad to see. So it seems like they are starting to crack down on some of these glitches and some of these problems that GTA Online is having, which is always awesome. So one thing that they did add was um, they fixed the mental state a little bit. Now the mental state will no longer increase when killing hostile mercenaries. And then also the increase rate for killing cops who are chasing the player as a result of being wanted has been reduced. Mental state will no longer increase for killing players who have a bounty on their head or for a player defending themselves when they have a bounty on them. So still no fix to like civilians which kinda is disappointing, I was hoping Rockstar would do that. Because killing civilians, you know, it doesn't really affect anybody. And that doesn't really determine if you are going to be a psycho or not. That just means you're in a hurry and you're probably wanting just to kill people, you know? Some of the fixes that they had, though. So, they fixed an issue where it's possible for a player's car to disappear if they left it at the start of a GTA race. They also fixed an issue where armored trucks would occasionally not drop any cash. They also fixed an issue where players could become stuck entering their garage if they had requested a vehicle from their mechanic while another player was in the garage. They fixed an issue where it was possible for player characters to spawn inside of Fort Zancudo. They fixed an issue where it was possible for planes to spawn with their landing gear down in death matches. They fixed an issue where players could spawn with a 4 star wanted level if they were killed by cops in the impound. They fixed an issue where players could spawn inside of and stand in vehicles. They fixed an issue where it's possible for players to fall through the world if they entered the PSN store while in their apartment. <laughs> they fixed an issue where players were able to enter their garages with NPCs in their vehicles. <laughs> they fixed the big issue where players were able to trap other players inside their personal vehicle. I know that's actually happened to me a couple times, so I'm glad they fixed that. Now some of the exploits that they fixed, the major one with the UFOs in public sessions, so that should be good. They fixed various exploits where players were able to duplicate vehicles, so no more money glitches. They also fixed an exploit where players were able to respawn in their garages after committing suicide. They fixed an exploit where players could get all barber services for free. They also fixed an exploit that allowed players to go off the radar. And they fixed an exploit that allowed players to become invincible. And then the last one they fixed where players were able to drive inside of their garages. So overall, not that many. I'm glad to see Rockstar is sort of getting their stuff together, you know, right before all these big things are coming out. Heist, next gen, maybe casino, whatever. But still, you know, this is good news. There's still some things that need to be fixed, you know, uh, some of the gameplay mechanics, I think at least. But, you know, they are fixing some of the problems with the game. So that's always awesome. Let me know in the comment section, though, what is your favorite thing out of this entire DLC? I just want to know. I think for me, I'm loving the rocket launcher firework. That is just super awesome to mess around with, with friends and stuff like that. So uh, let me know yours in the comment section. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Share this video, subscribe, all that stuff. And as always, support Saints fan. I'm out. Peace.